I am Suzanne Wagner and I'm doing my personal quote and blog for the 27th of June 2022. Thank you for joining me. My quote for today, love is the compass that shows us the way. Love is the star that inspires more play. Love is the hope of another day. Love is the goal from which we all too often stray. And my blog for today. Today, the 27th of June, would have been my dad's birthday if he was still here. And it is my best bet friend's birthday also. Is that an accident? I think not. I find the patterns within numerology and astrology so interesting, if that's not already obvious. Does the person born on this day hold a vibration of energy that is familiar and that gives us something that we seem to energetically resonate with? Or, that, or is that what attracts us to them? I believe it does. Both of these people hold traits that I admire and respect. I see their brilliance, talent, determination, and willingness to work through many challenges and to embrace the choices that were made as they learn to appreciate the refining fires of karma. While they are very different in their careers, each were very successful and they both chose a rat to radically change their lives at a point where it became clear that certain things were no longer serving and that a complete break from the old world was necessary to become happy. At that realization, both made a leap of faith out of a life that showed a powerful manifestation of their ego in favor of a simpler way of being with less stress and more joy. I believe this was not just important for them, but perhaps more important for me to learn from them to watch and observe that process because I too had to leap multiple times away from gorgeous manifestations that my ego created in favor of the paths that pointed towards my own salvation through peaceful engagements and greater insight and awareness. As a numerologist, I see it so often that in one day I will get coming into my office or on the phone everyone with the same birth date. How does that happen? And it will not be their birthday that particular day. And I say that because I do get birthday discount specials for all my clients and so people will come in on their birthday, but that's not what I'm talking about. I often see those that come in with the same or very similar numerological patterns also and choices around mates and children. I marvel at the complex mechanism of space and time that manages to, to make such a synchronicity happen. The divine must really have to work overtime for that to consistently happen. Even on the Facebook birthdays, I love to see those that hold the same month and day of their birthday together, and I can sense this connection that they all seem to hold with each other. I was born at the same month and day as the musical star Madonna, and while our lifestyles were very different, we shared many similar qualities. She had a trauma related to her mother's death, and my mother also had emotional traumas that put our family through a lot. Madonna was in New York City at the same time as myself, but I was at Juilliard and she was struggling as a dancer, singer, and squatting in buildings to survive. We both loved to sing and dance. We both experienced passion for those things and managed to find success as we followed our dreams. We are both perfectionists and others see us as difficult at times because of our demanding natures. We both reached towards spiritual doors and found lifestyles of more peace and contentment as we aged through those processes of personal growth and the tools of conscious awakening. I find these things more than interesting and they help me recognize that perhaps we are all one giant being of light, having many experiences and versions of ourselves simultaneously in this domain of linear time. While we are special, there are reflections and other mirrors of other versions of us wandering around out there. I hope someday that each of you can bump into one of yours. It is fabulous to see what another version of ourselves can teach us. They can show us new ways while helping us understand and appreciate our own uniqueness. Thanks everyone. Have a great day.